How do you check if a 3D model is manifold or watertight? In order to 3D print something successfully, it's a good idea to have a model that doesn't have any holes and is fully watertight and doesn't have any extra pieces on the inside. There are many ways to do this, but an easy way is to use Blender. Inside Blender, you can install the 3D Print Toolbox add-on. There's a link in the description on how to install the 3D Print Toolbox add-on, and that way you can make your 3D mesh manifold for 3D printing inside Blender. Once you have the add-on installed, press N, then click on 3D Print. You can check all, and it'll give you a report. After it's done checking, it'll give you a report on how many non-manifold edges, bad contiguous edges, intersect faces, zero faces, zero edges, non-flat faces, thin faces, sharp edges, and overhang faces. The most important one for 3D printing is this non-manifold edges. If you twirl out cleanup, simply click make manifold. This will go through the process of making the model manifold for 3D printing. It modified 132 vertices, 402 edges, and 261 faces. Then if I click check all again, then we can see that now there are only four non-manifold edges. If you want to track down those last four non-manifold edges, you can click your model, then tab into edit mode, then select this. This will highlight the edges, and then you can go around into the model to find them. It can sometimes be hard to see, so you can go view, frame selected, and then it's going to frame where those non-manifold edges are, and they're in here somewhere. And sometimes what you can do is just press X to delete those edges. And then we can check all again. Now it has five non-manifold edges. That's because we probably created a hole. So if I click make manifold, it added one face. That's exactly what we wanted to do. So now if I click check all again, most likely it will have zero non-manifold edges. Now we have zero non-manifold edges. In this particular case, deleting the edges was the easiest thing to do. Sometimes you might see a triangle hanging off the edge, and then you can just delete the face. That's always different depending on your particular model. Now that I have a clean manifold mesh, I can go ahead and export it as an STL. Just go to File, Export, STL.